plus a few other odds and ends of things I just received. And I am so, so excited for a couple of reasons. First, this is the first haul on my channel. I am like a regular everyday person who just got their first job. I cannot afford to go on hauls very often. Uh, typically, I just like, you know, if I go to Ulta, I'll pick up like one thing. But the second most exciting part about this haul is that I got some really, really good deals. So I'm excited to share those deal with, deals with you, I think. Um, there should still be time for you to catch these deals, I think. I ordered them online, so they had to like get shipped to me before I could haul it. <laughs> I spent, in total, on this Ulta haul, um, $49, which is a lot for me to spend. For some of you, that might just be like chomp change, and for some of you, that's a lot. Uh, for me, that's a lot, and I got a palette that's regular $44, so... I feel justified, but you can make your own decisions. Let's start with that palette. I got the Tartlet palette. So this is like the packaging and it comes like this. And I've heard a lot of good reviews about this. Like a lot of people love this palette, so I've been kind of wanting to try it. BoxyCharm is pretty, has kind of got me into liking Tarte a lot, so. Um, but I had never tried their eyeshadows. So, these are the shadows in it. It's very neutral, it's kind of pinkies. Um, I'll swatch a few. Let's see. They feel so nice on your finger. And I did use it just for today um, to do my eye makeup for this video. So, I'm just gonna. I went really neutral. I didn't like layer a ton on, but I still think I was pretty impressed with it picking up. I just swatched this highlight, um, Free Spirit, Natural Beauty, and then not the darkest one, the second to darkest bombshell. And this is what they are. So the highlight is really light. It almost matches my skin tone, but you might be able to see it. Um, but very, very pigmented. I'm so excited to use this. Alta did just send me an email. I don't know if it's to all point holders or if it's like those who have reached a certain amount or if it's just in celebration of the birthday or whatever, but um, I already had 200 points. So that's six reward dollars. Um, and they added an extra 100 points on that, so $3. So I was able to save $9 just using my Ulta Rewards points. The other thing I spent money on, um, and that's because the Tarlet palette is $44. Um, you have to spend $50 in order to get free shipping, and shipping is like $5. So I was like, I would be spending $50. So I was like, I'm going to find something. I don't have much for concealers, and I thought I would give this a try. It's a duo. It has a concealer. And, anyway, it's the Benefit Boing and Eye Bright. I tried this today and I'm not totally sure about it. I mean, I put the Eye Bright a little bit right here. And I did put a little bit of the concealer on. I'm just honestly not very good at concealer. It looks like this. So I'm going to give it a good try. And I'll get back to you um, that this was $12. However, I still got more than just those two items. Um, they've been having this deal for quite some time. And I think I got this on the last day of it. So you might not be able to get this anymore. However, they do deals like this all the time. So putting this out to you as a, like, Ulta. Like, if you're going to don't spend money very often... Um, wait till the deal like this comes up. Um, basically it's a, I don't know, 16 piece sample bag. So it comes in this nice bag and typically I'm not like, send me a makeup bag because I do Ipsy and I get a ton of makeup bags. But like this is twice the size of an Ipsy bag. So I feel like it could have a different purpose than what I use those Ipsy bags for. So I like this one. 
And I gotta say, last month, Ipsy had the herringbone kind of texture on it. So is that coming back in style? Do you guys know? I'm gonna show you everything that's inside here. It's like pretty cool. There is a Ultimate Miracle Worker Rejuvenating Cream, just a little foil packet um, from Philosophy. They have a coupon for $5 off any Ulta product. I really haven't tried Ulta products, so um, I don't know. $5 off spending $10. The Body Shop Vitamin C Glow Boosting Moisturizer. This is a tiny sample, but um, I'm on the lookout for a good moisturizer, so any suggestions, please let me know. Gucci, Gucci bamboo um, perfume sample. It's like a little tiny bottle, which I don't mind. I use these. I have a couple. I don't wear perfume very often, but um, I like when they're in a little tiny bottle like this. I don't mind it. And it looks like it has a little sprayer. I have one that could like pop off the top and it's really hard to use. But this looks usable with a little sprayer. We're still going. And it's just a Tarte Park Avenue Princess and Glisten Amazonian Clay blush on just like a little throwaway sheet. Um, I have Park Avenue Princess, but I'm excited. I would definitely like to try that blush out. Um, the Park Avenue Princess I'm not like wowed by. It's not like right for my skin tone, I think. An Algae Brightening Mask by Algenist. And still another just like packet, but who doesn't love masks? Spa day! Another perfume sam sample by Juicy Couture and Hollywood Royal. And they still have a spray nozzle too. This one looks bigger than the Gucci. Photo Paris Shampoo. I have a pretty good shampoo I like, so I will still use them, but, like, I'm not going to transfer what I use. Um, mint almond oil shampoo and conditioner. That's a pretty good size. I feel like that would last more than once. A okay, book of shadows samples, which those are just little cards I'll show you. This is actually going to be my third one of these because when Sephora had their, like, come get a free sample of these, I went and then I got my mom to go, so I'd have two. So <laughs> I just used them all up in my project pan. So you haven't seen those, go watch those. But um, yeah, they're restocking me, I guess. Mario Badass Goose Skincare Cellophane Drops. I don't know if I'll even use that one. It's a firm, tight, and smooth skin. I don't need to do that. Okay. Uh, Smashback. Auto finish primer. I have a deluxe sample size of this, so I'll still, still use it. Um, okay. Laura Geller Glam Lash Dramatic Volumizing Mascara. I'm very excited about this because it's a good size, and I haven't really tried anything from Laura Geller. <laughs> I could use more mascara. Okay. Um, Benefit Fake Up. Hydrating Crease Control Concealer. So I'm excited about this because if that other benefit bowing doesn't work, this might, although this is probably like to actually conceal, cover things up. Ooh. This is kind of cool. I'm going to show you that on the packaging. It says like hydrating ring, contour hydrant, and concealing core. It's a real, <laughs> this big packaging only has that much product. Like, that's all the way rolled up. So, I'm excited to try it. I just think it's funny that, like, they invested this much money to, like, get this cute packaging with only that much product. You could have done a little less on the packaging and given me a little bit more product, but, you know. They didn't ask me. Okay, we're almost done. Um, Kendra Fast Dry Hairspray. I'm excited about this because I'm still trying to find a good hairspray. Ulta Lip Crown in Date Night. Really dark. Yeah, really dark. Last product. Um, Sheer Blonde Go Blonder Lightening Spray. I don't know that I'm going to be able to like use that. Maybe I'm feeling really adventurous. It's John Frieda, but he has like brunette stuff. And 
I feel like this would be a bad idea. <laughs> Maybe I should give this away to someone. That was everything in this bag. And then they also, like, just because you got that sample bag, you can still ask for um, them to send samples. Because in every purchase, online purchase, also throws in samples. Um, and so I picked the variety pack, and that came with a photo finish primer. So now I have two of these little tiny samples. Um, and Maybelline Fit Me um, Matte and Poreless Foundation, um, which I'm not doing matte and poreless. I'm wearing the dewy and smooth foundation today. Phew. So for $49, that's everything I got in my Ulta haul. I have a few other things I want to share with you. So I also am a member of Random Acts of Makeup on Reddit. And so it's just a makeup community of people. And I enjoy it. And they do exchanges every now and then. Um, I've done two exchanges and they are doing one currently right now but you have to like be a member and be active. I've kind of like haven't been super active lately so I'm not doing this one but I just got done with the like Christmas in July. It ran a little late and then I've been away from school and I had it so I had it since moving and I had it shipped to my parents house so I was finally able to go and get that this weekend. Um, so I thought I would just add that to this little time here. Um, yeah, so I did the like $20 to $30 range of like what they can spend, the amount that they should spend on you so that people get like a fair trade. Um, and I got, the main product they sent me is this um, Benefit High Beam. So I'm getting a lot more Benefit. I am wearing it today tried to put it on. Um, I like it. I was a little terrified at first because it like looks like nail polish but it really does come on like like dots and then I just blended it in with a beauty blender. Um, so I'm in love with highlighters right now so very really excited about that. Then she sent me NYX Butter um, Lipstick in Pops which I already have so I gave that to my mom to pass on to someone because um, I already, this is my version. Um, but I love it. Um, I'm wearing the Hunk, the purple one today. I have, she got me the NYX lipstick in Fig. Let's see what color this is because I don't have it. So I'm going to go ahead and open it up. Ooh, it's like this. Very like, that could be really pretty. And she also sent me cookies. <laughs> So, I really suggest that if you like makeup and, yeah, it's a really cool uh, forum. Um, I also got one more thing. Even if you just, like, buy from Sephora once a year, literally, if all you do is buy one thing from Sephora once a year, get on their rewards card. Um, you probably won't rack up a lot of points <laughs> if you go once a year. But they send out emails that are like, for our beauty insiders, come to Sephora and get a free sample. And you don't have to buy anything. You just go there say, hey, I want to pick up the sample, and they give it to you. Um, so I also have this Makeup Forever Deluxe in Pexi Gloss. It's <laughs> the cutest applicator. Right there. So that's a pretty good size sample and that'll last me a while. So highly suggest that you get on Beauty Insiders. Okay, this is just like a quick update. I like filmed that. Then I went to Walgreens to pick up a photo order and I spent a little bit more money. But you're going to be impressed, so I had to share it with you. I only got two things, so it's just a quick add-on. Every time I go to Walgreens, before I go, I look on my phone or computer and I add coupons uh, from the website. And so they had a couple deals going on. Um, 2000 Spend $10 and get 2,000 points. Every 5,000 points, you get $5. So not too bad, so... I clipped that my card and then the biggest deal going on right now is for Maybelline. So there's you can get $2 off on face products and $1 off 
lip products and $1 off eye products. So what I did was I clipped all this in my card. It's like, I'll just see what they have when I get there. Um, I didn't look at the ad, but normally I do. So I got there, and on the ad this week, which they normally, Walgreens normally does a lot of buy one, get one 50% off. So but the brands vary. But this week, Maybelline is buy one, get one 50% off. So <laughs> I picked up a face and an eye product. So that way I could use the $2 off and then the $1 off. So I would save $3.00. And, but they still both apply the buy one, get one 50% off. So I got the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer and the Color Tattoo in Leather because these are expensive, but I love them so much. And so since I could get it 50% off, I was like, I'll go for it. Um, I spent $9 for both of these plus 2,000 points to go onto my card. So I thought that was a really good deal. Just wanted to share that real quick since I was hauling. <laughs> so that's everything in my haul. I kind of splurged this month just because I got my first paycheck and I thought I deserved it. So keep a lookout for those deals. I'm all about a good deal and I feel like I got a really good one this time. So, um, let me know in the comments below if you've tried some of these in the samples or the Tartlet palette or whatnot. Let me know what you think. Um, and I'm excited. So uh, thank you for watching. Like, comment, or subscribe. <laughs>